where Arthur Weinstein works. I guess he just advises the IDSA panel. It's 20 to 5. He gets up at 5 o'clock. We're going to drop off one of the films. And some of the information for May Day and ask him what his deal is. Yeah, is uh, Dr. Weinstein available? I do not. I am not. Um, my name is Tim, and uh, I actually made a movie about my disease, and I wanted to give him a copy of it. Tim, what company are you with? I'm with Andalusian Dogs. Andalusian? Andalusian Dogs. Do you have a car with you? I do not. Mm -hmm. Dr. Weinstein? Yes. Timothy Gray. Hi. Hi. I made a movie called Under the Eight Ball about Lyme disease. Yeah. Oh, that movie? No. Nope. No. No, I drive, uh, actually brought one here for you to take a look at. Okay. Uh, you're a member of the IDSA board, correct? No. no you were. I've been a consultant. Okay. So you helped them I make helped. decisions. We've talked on the phone before. Right. Yeah, no, no, I have. I've been a consultant to them. Well, I'd like to drop off a copy. Because I'm not an infectious the idea of Well, how is, what is your I'm association? I'm a rheumatologist. Right, but what is your association with them? That, I mean, as a consultant, it's not... When they publish some stuff, I look at it and, make, and critique it. Um, so you're part of the peer review? With the, I, mean, I have been, and, and, what, and their guidelines. Yeah. yeah. So this is, this is a copy of Under the Eight Balls about my sister. Lori, who actually passed away from Lyme disease, which is, you know, something that the guidelines... Was post-mortem? Post-mortem? Yeah, no, she was diagnosed before that. No, I know that, but when she passed away, did they do a post-mortem to prove she, that it was Lyme disease? Yes, we did. I did one independently, actually, because they wouldn't do one because they diagnosed her with ALS. And once you get an ALS diagnosis, you're basically, that's a death sentence, even though she tested positive. She had three bands. Three bands is not positive. Yes, it is. One band is positive. Yes, it is. Absolutely. Thank you. She died. This is, you know, I mean, you're basically, you know, an accessory to homicide. I, am I? Am I? You have one antibody, you're not positive for Lyme disease. That's right. The flagellin doesn't prove it. Right. It doesn't. Right. You brush your teeth and get a flagellin. Right. So you're just doing your job? Are you just doing your job then? I, yes, I do my job. Is that you're just doing your job? Sorry. Uh, sooner or later, it's going to come to a head. You're going to have to answer to certain people. You're going to have to sooner or later.